Got a couple things on my mind this evening, and neither of them has anything to do with the final wager. Welcome, I'm Keith Williams. First, I want to talk about Sasha's True Daily Double. A lot of people come onto the show thinking, you know, I just don't want to finish in the red. I want to be around for Final Jeopardy. But sometimes you have to do that. You have to risk everything. And he made the right play. It would have been interesting to see what would have happened had he been around for final with fun and games as the category. I'm guessing he would have liked that, as did I. Now about that last clue, <clears throat> Alex did explain one way to find it, and this is one of my favorite mind puzzles, because it appears frequently on the SAT. We've got eight here, eight here, eight here, eight here. So that's 32 total, but this one and this one, and this one, the four corner spaces, you're counting twice. So you have to subtract four. 32 minus four is 28. A similar type of problem is the one where you say, okay, there are a certain number of kids in the class, 12 of them play soccer, 18 of them play baseball, and seven of them play both. And no kid, all the kids play one or both, or the, one or the other or both. How many kids are in the class? Easiest way to do this is to draw a Venn diagram. Say, okay, here are all the kids who play soccer. And here are all the kids who play baseball. Start in the middle. How many kids play both? That's where the overlap is, seven. And now I know that 12 kids play soccer, so that in this soccer circle, I need seven plus something to equal 12, that's going to give us 5. And over here, I have 18 kids playing baseball, which is 7 plus 11. So you add those all up, you get 12 plus 11 is 23 kids. If you want a quicker way to do that, 30 kids total, but you're double counting 7 of them. 30 minus, 20, or 30 minus 7 is 23. Same deal. I hope that was interesting and useful, but it's nice to be able to do that once in a while. All right, uh, new champ again in Matt, and we'll see how he does in his first title defense. Hope you'll join me tomorrow on the final wager.